show your own MySpace. <laughs> no! Alright, so this is, um... Uh, oh yeah, you did show, you did show my top 8 before my top 16. Oh, did I? Yeah, because uh, Zen Mode Man was top 16, he was the Metaphys, and, uh... Top 8 was the Pendulum Match. <laughs> well, if the two of you just oh, yeah, shut okay. up so about it, no one would know the difference. Oops. <laughs> Right. Literally, no one would. <laughs> Literally, until we watch the pendulum match again. <laughs> well, we'll watch the moment. We, we can do that. Um, so this is uh, Hecta Endemics. This is the round two, I guess. This is top eight, uh, number one seed versus the number eight seed. Silly, gullible little Hector. Hector went undefeated in uh, Swiss. He did. He was the only one who went 7-0. Oh. Rivalry. The Sulkiness with the... With the... Uh, uh, mind crush is cute. Mm -hmm. Continuously mind crushing a bunch of uh, mon uh, monsters and traps that all activate in the graveyard. <laughs> yeah, about that. Oof. Oof, the Storm Duster. I love me some heavy storm duster. Card puts in a work. Yeah. I think that um, he probably could have won otherwise, but that definitely solidly put the nail in the coffin. Remember to support the Divinator channel on things like Patreon, MySpace, Second Life, <laughs> <laughs> Grinder, Grinder, and Chatterbait. How do you support people on? Never mind. I don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so game number two. If you were paying attention. That's a lot of traps. <laughs> Is that my pass? <laughs> yeah, it's. Breaks are definitely putting in a lot of work there. Uh, he didn't open up Multi Faker and a lot of traps, so. Kinda of bricked. Yeah, four traps and a multi faker is better than five traps and none. Mm -hmm. And then the Imperial oh. Order is okay, I guess, but yeah, it's kind of dead. Yeah, you're stopping like literally one card, and that's the the rum card <laughs> and the burial. Oh, yay! I don't think he just had, didn't have a good side. Oh, waking the dragon. Too dead. Too dead. Too dead for me. <laughs> he just wanted Tom to pop it. Tommy he's managed got, to... He's got no way to bait him into popping them, though. Right. There's nothing that's set in that deck that would encourage someone to just pop them. No. Oh, he does. I sided, I sided that against Tommy the other day. Yeah. Little did I know he sided it against me as well, and I storm I storm dusted it. Nice. And he played Falcon and I had no out to it. Awesome. Felt bad, man. <laughs> I was like, where's my cat shark? No! So he managed to boost uh has needs to boost decode talker just to get over ultimate falcon. Just as Which is actually, you know That is what you would I do. like that. That is I what like you would that. do. All right. That's you right there. This is this is Benji's totally top eight <laughs> match, and not not the top sixteen. No, this is this was the yeah we showed the wrong one before. So this you were right. You, the Metaphys was your first first go around. I mean, it makes more sense that Metaphys would be sixteen and not eight, but you know yeah, that's just that's none of my business. <laughs> it was a deck I considered playing. Figured it'd be affordable. Yeah, this is Zen, Zen Mode been playing Metaphys and Slifer was playing uh, Pendulums from earlier. It's the it's the only deck in the game that can almost play Card of Sanctity. I guess. I, I tried it in uh, Shuranui's. Did it work? No. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I tried. The dream is to get it to work, because if it did work, it'd be a good draw card. Tell better, better Dave be... to post his YouTube channel. Better run. Is he is, is he teching uh is he teching Grand Meju Garzette in here? Uh I don't remember. Or no. 
Gray, uh, not not Garzad, uh, De Erza. The one, one gets Punch Man. Hit. Yeah, the One Punch one Man. Punch! Uh, I don't think. <laughs> so. One time, I, I I summoned one with a Levy or the Sky Dragon. <laughs> like Weird I made it opponents. from my opponent. <laughs> it was pretty funny. That's a nice top card he drew there. Oh yeah, right? Yep. Macro. Right. Macro. It's convenient. <laughs> I mean, not that he doesn't have pseudo macro also. Right. I mean He's got I'm macro sorry about and... I'm sorry about whoever is playing the Infernoid <laughs> about to have a bad day. Yeah, the I mean if if you were able to out macro, he does have the different dimension ground set as well, so. Oof, look at that banish pile though. It's... Feels bad, man. Be able to get rid of both of those, but can you out it? But can, can you do you this? Out it? <laughs> can you out it? <laughs> like I can out it. I gotta be storm duster. And then this happens. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he opened up big, pretty well. Big old Trump wall back there. This is like the only misplay I think I made in this duel. Um, I forgot that the DDR is going to send the Pendulum Monster to the Banner Zone. Mm. You know, I'm like, oh, I got rid of it. Right. Oh no, it's back. Right. <laughs> is he going to play Borolo too? Borolo Dragon there. Ah. How many macro cosmoses can he hit you with? All of them. All of them. <laughs> Did I just see fusionist in the extra deck? <laughs> Fusion target for level three. Yes, yes, you did. <laughs> no instant fusion targets. <laughs> this is the first time I've chosen to go first. Okay. Just because you're like no macro for you. If I can get like I played a lot of back row hate in the. Uh... In the side deck, so I wanted to make sure that they go off. They were like Malevolent Catastrophe, oh, nice. Heavy Storm Duster, Cute. Uh, Red Malevolent Reboot. Catastrophe. You know what? That's your opponent thinks thing. you're. You think that your opponent thinks you're being cute with Mellow Seek, and you're like, like <laughs> that. Actually, that'd be funny. Like it'd be a it'd be a blowout. Yeah, my friend was playing in his ABCs for the Alter Geist match, so I'm like, oh, I'll play that. Seems good. Did he Did not he... call one? Or no, that's the uh, not reasoning. Like, yeah, no. you opened up. When I saw that you opened up. Oof, um, man, did you mill any more? Monster um, game. I was like, that's game. I think I mill 25. Yeah. When Look I saw, at the I saw deck the, thing uh, on that. You gotta deck yourself out, you jackass. <laughs> <laughs> Blow up those stupid goats. <laughs> what format is this? Yeah, you're right. I need to show two more. So, never mind. Back to. <laughs> like I said, we're still in top eight. This is. Kren versus Enrotted. Uh, True Draco versus Mechlord uh, Trickstars. Uh, Zen Modeman said Fusion was, Fusionist was the meme budget extra deck card for Eater, Eater of Millions fodder. Mm. Uh, I approve. It works for me. If it was the cheapest possible extra deck monster, it was a good idea. If it's not, then you wasted money, you dork. I mean, it's a meme. I don't think yeah. I don't think Metaphys are that expensive. You probably hit like fifty bucks to blow. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody entered the tournament with a forty dollar deck. Yeah, but why would you do that? You wouldn't. There's no reason. With no intention to win. No, he didn't. If you managed to make your main deck an extra deck and side for forty dollars, I would throw in some hand traps. So like, you know what? <laughs> throw some drolls in there. <laughs> and evenly I, matched. And evenly matched. I got this. They won't see that coming. Hit him with an actual good card. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh oh. Oof, that's a bad top deck. All right. What song am I singing? Do it again. It's like do, do, happy, do, happy. Do, 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 do. 
Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I, can, I know exactly I can what it, it is. I can hum it right along with you, but I have no I idea. I have no idea what it is. Whatever. It's a Robin Thicke song. Is it now? That's all I know. <laughs> uh, well, we know the artist. We know the tune. I don't think I ever knew the artist, so I don't think that helps me. <laughs> oh, all I know is on the music video, his name pops up on the screen, okay. like hashtag thick all the time. Oh. Hashtag thick. T-H-I-T-I-C-C. A lot of true Draco. Uh, well, we're seeing the same people, but yeah, there was, I think, three true Draco. Two or three total. Keeps called Ooh, by the grave. Called by the DD grave, DDD God. <laughs> what is this? I don't think this stops uh, True Draco Phoenix, so I'm not sure it's even worth DD crowing these cards. No, I don't think it is. But yeah, that was a uh, True Draco moves on. Uh, <laughs> it's the third Johto theme from Dave. <laughs> All right. The Robin Thick song from Ryan. <laughs> no, that would be. Do 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 do. All right, so I, I don't think I've shown this one, right? This is this is new. Um, no, no. Okay, it's not we new. Faster, they oh, show is, you uh... skill. Everyone wanna get the faster, make right the way to the. Oh, I'll stop. <laughs> Gonna get us. I will. I will. I will be singing that. <laughs> If you don't stop me. <laughs> don't stop me now. Don't stop me. I'm having a good time. Having a good time. <laughs> Shooting star leaping through the sky like a tiger. There we go. Catch you on a different song. <laughs> the final law of uh, gravity. Yeah, the uh, pendulum. Stupid pendulums. Making well. the same stupid opening board. <laughs> Needs more Mound of the Bound in its trick star, Time Lords. <laughs> Notice he never plays it. Uh, yes. My, my point has been proven. If you're, you're seeing a card stuck in your hand majority of the time. He's bad. He's bad. He's bad. Waiting for the searches on the, uh, the reincarnation is... Quality. <laughs> Yeah, this is a, <laughs> certainly an interesting matchup. I like how he's playing that stupid Odd Eyes burst stream thing. Searcher? Card. It searches an Odd Eyes. It just searches. Yeah. It's just like Rota. Might as well play it. Gotcha. It does have that other effect. If you it, want to use it, I don't think anybody ever does. But yeah, it's literally just a, a searcher. Um, although Time Lord's Bad stuff. Dead Reboot. Red Dead Reboot? I'd like to see some Trickstar Mounds Bound. What? Are you talking about boobies? I think he's talking about boobies. <laughs> no. I can't be sure because it was a super clumsy joke. But <laughs> <laughs> well, you have, you have thoroughly destroyed the clumsy joke. Further. Yes, I am. Oh, he's taking burn for everything, right? <laughs> yeah, Candina is. Pick your nose, take 200. Probably better than Licorice in this case. <laughs> Stop activating spells! <laughs> he's gonna kill himself just by trying to play Yu Gi Oh! Yep, that's, that's accurate. So what we're gonna do is put a couple of Candinas and Licorices on board and. Wait. Really built for game. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Lily Bill for game. <laughs> Dude, that joke was a masterpiece. Nah, bro. Come on, mound of the bound. <laughs> Do it. Search, Search it. <laughs> Search it. You got a terraforming. You got this. It's got kaijus in there, too. What a mess. <laughs> <laughs> I think what? he. That was a. Uh, he was like, I, I'm still surprised that my deck keeps winning. This, this mess of a deck shouldn't be winning. Well, Trick Stars are known for being such a small, efficient engine, you can play literally anything else in them. True. Uh, so instead of the DD Crow, he decided to go with the Skullmeister. 
cute. Which is handy right there. Baroque. Good for the Baroque. This Very good. I wonder if he sided it. Which is a weird thing to side in for pendulums, but... Unless you actually were that 4D chess play, you're like, you know what? It has one application. Yeah. It stops Vortex. Right? I yeah. got this. But they can make it without the float, so I don't know. The uh, big brain play here is attacking into the tie-on, so... <laughs> don't, I don't know what that was supposed to accomplish. Well, they're pendulums. They just go back to your hand. You're like, oh, I just pendulum someone again. I just want to play them again next turn. Right? <laughs> or get reincarnation for more cards. I don't know. Yeah, I guess. That was the... <laughs> that would be the uber big brain. Like, well, you know, if my board's actually shitty. I'm going to bounce all this shit back and hope he reincarnates me just so I can get five new cards because damn. <laughs> oh, just so I could play the raccoon on his turn. Bumbuku? Wait, what? Bumbuku. Oh, it got act it had to be active in the end phase. Like, why is he using this chalice? Oh, oh yeah, because of light, light stage. Pendulum player is playing himself right now. You played yourself. Congratulations. You played yourself. <laughs> I mean, I guess you could, you would want to bounce Bunboku, but I feel like that was still a bad play. I don't think, yeah, I don't think he read the card or didn't expect it to be on both turns. Yeah, maybe. Maybe hey, he thought it was only Uter of Millions. I love Uter of Millions. It's a good little one-off tech card. And when your deck plays just a bunch of bullshit, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, it it fills a hole that Trickstar's need. A thirty five hundred attack, eater of millions. That's that's just strong for no reason. <laughs> Bert, put in some work. Mm -hmm. Actually, deals the final damage with it. What's up, douchebags? By the power of this heel of all my calculos, I command you to subscribe to the channel. Grab your deck and be sure to click one of these other videos by David AK1212. It's the best damn channel on the internet. Yeah, man. Yeah.